So, so thank you all and good afternoon. Um, I, I really want to, to take a moment to thank Dr. Stanton. Um, this is, as he described, a locomotive that's moving down the tracks. It's moving down the tracks because of the time, the investment, and the energy that you all put in on a daily basis, but that you all put in together with Dr. Stanton for the better part of a decade and a half. It's rare that you have the opportunity to meet someone, to really hope that you'd have the opportunity to work with someone, to look at someone as a mentor, and now to look at someone as a colleague. But I have that opportunity every day of the week. Um, there's not a better person in Tennessee than Paul Stanton, and I'm honored to have the chance to continue to work with him but in a little bit of a different capacity than we'd envisioned a few years ago. But I'm also extremely honored to have the opportunity to work with you because there's great things happening across this campus on a daily basis, and there's great things happening in East Tennessee on a daily basis because the people here. Um, summer's supposed to be a time to slow down. You know, <laughs> students go home, things are supposed to slow down. But as you look around campus, you all are working day and night to get things ready for the fall. And the summer is the opportunity that we have to make the investments and the improvements in our infrastructure and in ourselves from a professional development perspective to prepare for the return of our students. Because at the beginning of the day and the end of the day, that's why we're all here for the students, for our 15,500 students who put their hopes and dreams in your hands. Uh, they couldn't be in more capable hands than the hands of the individuals that I look out at today. Uh, this is an amazing institution from the things that happen in the Culp Center to the things that happen in the Dome to the things that happen in housing and residence life. They happen because of you. And I'm honored to be part of this team and I'm honored to be part of this family. Uh, I want to thank James and, and staff for all of their work in pulling this together. Um, I don't know if I'm going to wear this hat tonight at a fundraising event in Kingsport, um, <laughs> but we'll see. I don't know how it would go with the tux, but we'll see. Uh, I'd like to turn it back over to James Batchelder, the head of staff, and really thank you all very much.